Let's do the album Transformers Studio Selects um, Generations um, Hotshot. He is in his robot vehicle mode and it looks really cool in my opinion. It's, it's one of my favourite vehicle modes of um, Siege and Selects because it looks so good and it looks so much like a video game vehicle, vehicle called the Warthog in Halo. It's, very, it's a really good game Halo. But we're not, we're not talking about Halo right now, we're talking about Transformers. So here he is, here it is. I'll show you the and it looks really, really good. I really like the paintwork they've done. Like the hound would look like a full on homage vehicle. And this looks really, really good. This hot shot is from the Savage One Hot Shot. <coughs> so basically, it is like the person. So it is hot. So basically, the Savage One, uh, you know, Transformers Savage One. It's hot shot from there because probably they made it to go with the um, Savage One Optimus Prime. But this hot shot is a really good one. I think it's from the Savage One. It looks like it's from the Savage One because Savage One does hot shot does turn into a truck. Does Enjoin? I don't think Enjoin does, but yeah. So it is his real command. Oh, that's good. Oh, 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 oh. And you can take off guns. So you can have any of the guns if you wish. I prefer them with the guns because it looks less better and it looks less pain. And you can um, put the gun. And attach them together, which will come in this really, really cool assault rifle, which is silver, red, and black. And it's a really, really nice looking color card. Better than the hound, because hound's just black and silver. This is like red, silver, and black. It has more detail. It's pretty cool. Let's stop talking about the gun. Let's the figure and get the card. Because mode again. Here is the front. It looks really good, like the paintwork in this thing is so good. It looks very good. I wish they had like backlights because that would make the book mode look better. But yeah, I still really like it a lot. It's a really good figure. Um let's start transforming. So what the first thing to do is we go over here. Yes. There you go, and then we want it to come up. Mount. Put legs. Legs. Then we're going to come around. Keeps moving. Move. Um, uh, here. Um, push that in there. Come down here. Legs. So this bit does come off, it does come off also on the hand. I think it's the issue uh, issue with the mode. But I would have preferred them if they did um they did uh, put um, like wads so it'd be better the hood better. But maybe they did that because if kids buy them buy it, you know, they would, you know, break it. It makes sense why they did that. But I like, because I'm a collector, I would prefer a wad. But here is him in his boot mode. He looks really, really, really good. Like, has a new face. Nothing like the hound. And that's really the only thing that's been molded. Does have articulation. It is very, very good. I'll show you articulation in a minute. So here he is in his 
Close mode, spin it around, detail, right there, face, the face. Very nice face. It's a really good face. So then, yeah. Really good figure. It does have auto, um, articulation. So articulation is, the head is on a ball joint. So it goes up and down, spins. Arm goes all the way around. Spin that way. Go up that way. Go back that way. And it has close articulation, kick up, kick back that way, bend there, bend there, and has hill articulation. And you can give him his guns. So just take that so we can make him hold the guns like that. And then we can also take this and just, just reattach it like that. Give him his, and then here he is all decked out with his weapons. It is definitely really good. I really like this figure. I I really love the paintwork. It's so good. And then I'll get his um leader, his master. Big boy Prime. Here they are. His Prime is bigger than Mr. Hotshot. Like I really like the like Hotshot. It's a really good figure, and making him standing next to um, Cybertron Optimus Prime, it just looks really good. And it's good that I finally have a Cybertron or, or have a Hotshot because I've never had a Hotshot. I ne I wasn't able to get the Armada or um, or. Cybertron or Energon, but I've heard they're not good figures, so I didn't buy them. So I was looking forward to when I heard that they have it, like they were making a Steel Selects version, and I was so happy. But let's take time away, and it looked good to go, and it would be cool to put them on the shelf to go. But like, I really like this hot shot. I picked him up from a comic shop called Forbidden Planet. You can go there right now, or you can go on any online retailers. Like for um, for in demand and Kapow toys, they will probably have them in stock. But I really, really like this figure, and I think you should pick him up. He's definitely a very good figure to have in your collection, and my opinion, he's so good, and it's a really, really good figure. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. See you guys next time. Bye.